Let's see if he's all there. On the big tree. Oh yeah, I did. All right, Haley, you're closest. I want you to come down here and find this one. Um, so that guy is a tooth from the um, species of mako shark still alive today. That's Isurus oxyrhynchus. Let's see the other side on that. Yeah. That's a Excellent. good one. Mm-hmm. <laughs> yeah. All right, so Rob here just made his trip worth it by finding this tooth. This is a giant thresher shark tooth in really excellent shape. So this is from Alopius grandis. And you can even see there is a slight curve on the labial side showing that this guy has a slight pathology to him so a little bit of deformation in the jaw that one is a really great find there good job Looks like it would have been an arrowhead. Yes, so wow. Christina just got an arrowhead out here. That is a pretty unusual find for us. This is the third one I've ever seen out here on the river. That is a beautiful point there. We'll uh, message one of our contacts to figure out the type and the style of this one so we can get an age for you. Yeah. That is awesome. This one's tricky because it's buried under some plant matter there. Can you see it, Haley? Yes, sir. Oh, I do too. <laughs> there you go. Yeah, so that guy is going to be a juvenile from that predecessor of Megalodon. Okay, so Christina's got one down here, and this is more than just any old tooth. This is going to be the precursor of the great white shark that's alive today. You can see there is no serrations on the edge. Let's see the rest of this come out. That's a big one. That's one of the nice upper teeth from that species. Let's see the other side of it. Oh, gorgeous. Excellent find there, Christina. I don't know how much is there, but do you see it poking out? I'd say a good part of that was there, huh? <laughs> All right, let's go wash that one off at the water. Yep, that's another Angustodens right there. Beautiful. I was trying to get his attention. Alright, well right after Haley found hers, 
walk over here and Nisha's holding out on us. <laughs> Got these beautiful ones here. Another nice Angustidens right there. Got this one's actually the uh, early Miocene predecessor of Megalodon. Ooh. You can see his cusplet is a little more rounded out on the yeah. edge. So that's going to be Carcharicles chubutensis. Okay. You have a beautiful shark vertebra here from a member of the Megalodon lineage. Ooh. And even this guy is a really nice tooth from a whale. And this one's probably going to be from this unnamed genus. So it hasn't even been described to science yet. Oh! That is a beautiful tooth right there. Oh, I'm so excited. All it's right, so cool. nice finds. Thanks. Go for it. Yep, that so one's for the shine. another Angustidens. Are you looking for the gleam? Yep, oh, that, that blue gray shine of the enamel. So I can check this thing out. It looks like a coffee can. That's a big old chunk. That's not, that's not a chunk. Go ahead and pull that out. That. Is it a brick? Are we fooled? Here's a toothbrush. That might be a little squarer than I thought. Sometimes the uh, baleen whale vertebrae will be this large and and wash up in one piece. It's hard to tell. Let's Almost. give it a quick rinse there. And it looks like we just picked up a brick. Mm -hmm. oh, well. That's a really nice one though. It is a nice brick, you're right. <laughs> <laughs> so looks can be deceiving what may originally look like a rock that's completely encrusted in barnacles when flipped over if you notice this line running through it there and the fact that it's kind of pinched off on the end a little broken right here you'll notice that this is actually a piece of fossilized poop from a very large crocodile so this is called a coprolite that comes from the greek copros and lithicos for dung stone and that is a pretty big one it's a cool find right there playing right down here in the edge of the waves oh, you, Christina. <laughs> yeah nice little lower angustidens right there beautiful right. let's see if he's all there <laughs> all right looks like it's all there what do you think oh yeah <laughs> oh yeah beautiful so stacy just found this really cool dolphin tooth right here got some pretty wrinkled enamel on it this is either going to be one of the front teeth from a type of dolphin called a xenorophid or one called a squalidelphinid. That is a really nice little find.